Veterans Helping Veterans on this Christmas Eve. Some local vets got together for food, folks, fun, and fellowship. Our Tony Atkins shows us why it's important that this group is connected during the holiday season. For many veterans, finding a place to go on the holidays might sound simple, but it's not as simple as many people think. Today, one local veteran decided to get about 30 others out for a day on the lanes. Not a single gift in sight, but the presence of each other was enough for these veterans on Christmas Eve. Events like this, you know, they kind of help you just get outside of your head for a while. Samuel Brown was one of more than two dozen vets who made it out to bowl free of charge at the AMF lanes in West Dallas. The goal was simple, have fun. Right, there you go. And enjoy each other like family. But on Christmas Eve, a teammate of mine was killed in combat. Matthew McDonnell, an Army veteran, organized the event. He saw his friend, Enrique Mondragon, killed in the line of duty on Christmas Eve in 2012, a traumatizing experience that affected him for years. Is it bad for you? It used to be. Once you see some of the things that we saw in combat, I don't think you ever come back the same. But now all of these veterans are back, be it from Iraq, Kuwait, or Afghanistan. They're all thankful to have a good place to go for the holiday. How is this compared to your actual life? Trying to knock them all down. All of them? <laughs> That's the life plan, to knock them all down. Knocking down life's obstacles. On all the way home. Together. In West Dallas, Tony Atkins, today's TMJ4.